Hi everyone, I'm Tom. Imagine this, you've had a long, exhausting day at work. All you want is to come home, relax, and spend some time with your cat, Leo. But as soon as you walk through the door, you see that Leo is angry. You immediately know that you messed up. Here's what happened. I realized I'd be late coming home, so I texted my neighbor to feed Leo. But I accidentally wrote, please feed Leo at 8 a.m. instead of 8 p.m. Once again, I mixed up a.m. and p.m. This used to happen to me a lot, but now I've learned how to stop doing it. So I want to help you avoid making the same mistakes. First, it's important to know that we have two main ways to tell the time, the 24-hour and 12-hour clock formats. In the 24-hour clock, time starts at zero and goes up to 24. For example, if it's midnight on Friday, the time is zero, and by the end of the day, it's 24. You can also say zero on Saturday instead of 24 on Friday. However, in most English-speaking countries, the 12-hour clock is more commonly used. In the 12-hour clock, we have two periods, a.m. and p.m. A.m. stands for anti-meridium, which is Latin for before midday. It covers the time from midnight, 12 a.m., to just before noon, 11.59 a.m. P.m. stands for post-meridium, meaning after midday. It runs from noon, 12 p.m., to just before midnight, 11.59 p.m. Because people often confuse 12 p.m. and 12 a.m., it's more common to use the terms noon for 12 p.m. and midnight for 12 a.m. Here's how I don't confuse a.m. and p.m. anymore. I focus on the word post in p.m. Post means after, so I remember that p.m. refers to the time after noon. Now, whenever I see a.m. or p.m., I know exactly which one to use without hesitation. Another common way to tell time is by using the term a clock, which simply means according to the clock. For example, when we say nine o'clock, it means it's nine. Here are a few important things to remember. A clock is used only with the numbers one to 12. So we don't say 14 o'clock. We don't use a clock for times that include minutes or parts of an hour. So you wouldn't say 725 o'clock or half past six o'clock. Also, it's not common to use a clock with a.m. or p.m. So instead of saying 8 o'clock a.m., we usually say 8 o'clock in the morning. To summarize, we can tell the time in a few different ways. By just saying the number 10. By using a.m. or p.m., 10 a.m. By using a clock, 10 o'clock. Or for more clarity, you can say 10 o'clock in the morning. I hope you enjoyed this lesson. Thanks for watching and see you next time.